previously on Drooling Monsters. Stool Monsters, you nimrod. I'm back, baby. Oh, it looks like Merrick isn't Merrick anymore. He's actually Merrick. I can see sh**, but it sounds very confusing. So wait, is that the evil Merrick or the evil Merrick? Uh, the evil Merrick. Oh, now I'm up to speed. Enough of this! Merrick, I command you to win this game and take the Pharaoh's power into your hands. Then we will rule the world together. But you're just an eyeball now. How are you going to rule anything? I will blink at things angrily until they submit. No, I'm through with people telling me what to do. From now on, the only person who tells me what to do is me. But that's exactly who I am. There's only room for one Manic Ishtar on this planet. Wait. And it's not the Manic Ishtar that's not me. Wait, 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 Whoa! Hey, my crotch is back! Good to know, Yugi. It looks like Marek's evil half didn't stand a ghost of a chance. That joke doesn't really work in this context, Pharaoh. F*** you, it was funny. Oh, piss on that. If you'll all excuse me, I have prepared a list of people to thank who got me this far. Ahem. <laughs> me? There we go. Piss on you! Yog, you won! Just like you did in the last tournament and every similar encounter up to now! What an unpredictable adventure full of twists and turns! They like the part where we stood nearby and watched the important thing happen! Piss on all you guys! This was supposed to be my tournament. I spent like five hours arranging it. Five. Whole. Hours. Oh man, it looks like Kaiba's got a severe case of butt hurt. Somebody call the wambulance. Nobody call the wambulance. Hello, wambulance. My brother's butt is hurting. Mokaba, hang up that phone! But bro, your butt! I won't let my tournament end on such a mushy, positive note. I'm going to do something so horrible that it will steal all the attention from you guys and put it right back where it belongs. With Seto Kaiba. What are you going to do? Blow up the island and kill everybody? No. You sound like you're going to do that now. Come on, are you kidding? Come on, who do you take me for? Come on. Mokaba, ready the thermal charges. Okay. Here, Pharaoh, I bestow unto you the last of the Egyptian god cards. The winged dragon of... Ra I thought it was called Mega Ultra Chicken. Oh, that's right. I guess I forgot. That is inexcusable. You should be ashamed of yourself. I mean, it's just a trading card. Stop it's... ruining Yu-Gi-Oh, Marek! Pharaoh, it is now time for me to reveal the secret that I've been holding my entire life. Take a look at the... God damn it. This is very impressive, yes. No, not this. I'm trying to... Frank, damn it. Somebody help, I'm stuck. I'm very glad that I could be here for this moment. Shut up. Odeon, help me get undressed, please. Would you like your feedy pajamas, Master Merrick? No, I don't want my frigging feedy pajamas. O-M-E-G. Baby got back. Big time. Hamana, 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 hoo-wee. Oh, good. Now his pants are coming off, too. Great. Hamana, hamana, Behold, Pharaoh. I'm beholding. The secret to unlocking your hidden memories uh -huh. is written upon my back. Please don't turn around. And now my debt to you has been repaid. Oh my god, a giant cock! Inscribed upon my back are the answers to the mysteries of life, the universe, and everything. Shame I couldn't read it. What? Yes, it was all written in Egyptian. But... You're a pharaoh. But I don't have my memories, so the whole language thing is kind of a moot point. I've been carrying this secret on my back for years, just waiting for you. Well, maybe if somebody bothered to write it in English... It's supposed to help you. Sorry, but I think I actually know less about what I'm supposed to do now. Jeez. Gotta say, it's a pretty sweet tattoo, though. I know, right? All the dudes love it. What's that? All the ladies love it. Uh, okay. Uh, Merrick, could you put some pants on? I think Taya is clinically brain-dead right now. Now that Maddox's evil half has been sent to the Shadow Realm. All those he has banished are free to return. Like my! And that other guy! W what's his name? Barry? Yes, Barry. Good guy. I'm sure there will be absolutely no negative consequences to this. <laughs> nope. It's all good in the hood. Let's go check on my. Bet she's busy macking on some dude. Am I right? Eh? Oh, I wasn't right. She's in a coma. Sorry. 
My bad. Boy, are you okay? Jerry, she won't wake up. I think she's going to be in a coma forever. No, my, this can't be happening. I love you. I was gonna spend the rest of my life with you. Psych, I'm not really in a coma. I was just messing with you. What? Serenity was in on it too. What? <laughs> you should see the look on your face, big brother. Tricking people into thinking I'm a brain dead vegetable for five seconds was hilarious. Oh. I've seen some f***ed up things in my time, but that was the f***est uppest. What the hell is a kitchen room? I hope they have a bathroom room. Hello, blokes. I was bloody famished. But this nosh is scrum diddly umptious. A core at that food was meant to go to all the starving kids back home. Oh, bollocks. You monster. They knew he was evil. Stop ruining Yu-Gi-Oh, Bakora. And now we will fly away from the island at breakneck speed. <laughs> Oh, Shaisa! Hey, why ain't we taking off? Something appears to be wrong with the engines! Hey, Mokuba, I'm doing a really hard crossword puzzle. What's an eight-letter word that means to deliberately destroy, damage, or obstruct, especially for political or military advantage? Uh, sabotage? Bingo. You're not really doing a crossword, are you, bro? No, no, I'm not. Just think, Joey. If you hadn't passed out, they wouldn't have sent this helicopter to help you, and we would still be stuck on the island. Oh, yeah. Thank God I was almost brutally mated. What a relief. That is a huge load off my mind. Thank God that I almost was killed. You suck, Taya. I knew Kaiba didn't have the Karibos to blow up the island. Deep down inside, he's really just a soft-hearted, sentimental... That cold-hearted son of a bitch! Next time I see him, he gets a kick in the Karibos. I wonder if Kaiba's okay. Nah, he's gotta be toast. Good night, sweet douchebag. And a flight of blue eyes white dragons sing thee to thy- Yeah, holy crap, it really is a flight of blue eyes white dragons! <laughs> oh, my bad, Kaiba's not dead. Apparently, he survived by hiding inside a Fisher-Price toy. What in the flying blue crap is that? It's my own personal blue eyes jet. Jealous, Yugi? Of your completely ineffectual, impractical, totally not aerodynamic at all, childish-looking rocket ship? Oh, definitely. You don't look silly, Kaiba. Mokuba, you like the jet, right? He's insane. See, Mokuba's having a good time. About that whole trying to murder us thing. I have a blue eyes white dragon jet. Your argument is invalid. <laughs> <laughs> and suddenly, Kaiba games on motorcycles don't seem quite so ridiculous. Okay, Mokuba, let's go build Kaiba Land! Yay! Even though Kaiba Land was already featured in Season 1, we're going to go build it. Again, I guess. Yay! Screw you, continuity! Pharaoh. I cannot thank you enough for helping my brother. Yes, apparently losing that card game made me not insane. Who needs expensive therapy when you have expensive trading cards? Thanks to you, Fado, I am now able to go back to my normal life. Living underground in the middle of buttfuck nowhere, guarding some dead guy's tomb. Oh, thank the gods you helped me out. Try not to go crazy again and kill everybody. I promise nothing. You know, I think I'm kinda gonna miss that homicidal maniac. Yes, I quite enjoyed that one conversation I had with him. There goes a man with a very sexy midriff. Learned something about you today, Tristan. I should go too. This whole experience has given me some ideas. I'm going to host a Dungeon Dice Monsters tournament in Domino City, and the winners of each game have to give each other their rarest dice. So it's just like Battle City? No, it's nothing like that. Only with dice. E yeah. Get out of here, you hack. My, don't go. I have to, Joey. But I probably love you and stuff. Really? Tell me one thing about my character that doesn't involve my breasts. Well, you got a great ass. Bye, Joey. Wait, come back, my. Apply the handbrake, you dumb broad. Man, this is like the third time a girl's rejected me for insulting her and treating her like a piece of meat. I wonder what I'm doing wrong. Battle City's over, but there's one more thing we have to do. Joey deserves a fair duel to win back his red eyes. Unfortunately for him, he's dueling me. Maybe we could go easy on him this one time. Yugi, he uses Swordsman of Landstar. Unironically, he deserves everything he gets. We gotta get out of here. I just hope I don't wake Grandpa. Yugi! Are you trying to run away from home again? Uh, no, of course not, Gramps. Why would I want to leave? You're such great company. I love having to change your bed sheets every five hours. And oh man, your war stories, they're so captivating. That reminds me, did I ever tell you about the time I single-handedly slaughtered an entire squadron of- Wait, where did he go? Did I imagine all of that? Do I even have a grandson? 
Hello? Am I in Fight Club? It's just you and me, Yug. Time to put my experience to the test. You bet, Joey. And remember, if you believe in the heart of the cards, you can accomplish anything. Hey, thanks for playing, Yug. What? How the hell did you beat me? Well, like you said, I believed in the heart of the cards. But I made all that shit up. I, I mean, um, uh, maybe we don't talk about this next season, okay? I have a reputation to uphold and all. Sure thing, Yug. But oh man, what a duel, huh? Yes, it was uh, quite a contest. Totally had you on the ropes. Yeah, it was touch and go. I can't believe I beat you with Swordsman of Landstar. Stop ruining Yu-Gi-Oh, Joey! <laughs> Are you ready to be f***ed, man? I see you roll your way into the semis. Dios mio, man. Liam and me, we're gonna f*** you up. Yeah, well, you know, that's just like, uh, your opinion, man.